This team from the Department of Wildlife and Conservation is getting ready for a mission to save one of the less spoken wild species in Sri Lanka. Since Sri Lanka is a relatively small island with a rich diversity of wild fauna, there are ample instances where humans and wildlife interact. Such conflict is widespread in rural Sri Lanka where crops are being cultivated. The mission for the wildlife officers today is to save a wild buffalo that has invaded the human settlements. In general, the wild Asian buffalo is considered to be an endangered species according to the IUCN Red List. One primary reason for this decline is the hybridization, with the domestic buffalo species losing their genetic diversity. Wild buffalo in Sri Lanka is a species that has led to many debates. Some have argued this species to be the same as the domestic buffalo, while some stated otherwise. However, Research measuring the skull of the feral buffaloes in Sri Lanka has identified it as a separate species or a subspecies of the domestic water buffalo. According to the data available, the wild buffaloes of Sri Lanka were only about 2,000 in 1994. It is obvious that this number is even much lower at present, and therefore this species is a species that needs meticulous protection. Therefore, this mission is vital on both sides, the buffalo and the humans. The team is now trying to isolate the wild buffalo before darting him with the sedatives. Since these wild beasts are strong and ferocious, handling should be done with caution. If not, there's a high chance of receiving fatal injuries from his attacks. <laughs> Oh, let's tell the balance. 
Finally, they were able to sedate the wild buffalo safely and translocate him to the wild, ensuring safety of both the buffalo and the villagers.